six years before Hayden Hurst first caught a touchdown in the NFL, he was throwing pitches after having been drafted by the Pittsburgh Pirates. But in the fall of 2012, when he was 19, something was wrong. Things just kind of didn't seem right when I would throw. I was overanalyzing things and then sweaty hands and my hand would start to shake. The cause at the end of my baseball career was um, the yips. He called me up one day and said, I can't do this anymore. I'm leaving to go play football, and I'm going to go walk on. In 2015, Hurst walked on to the football team at the University of South Carolina. He would become a star tight end for the Gamecocks. But his emotional struggles continued. It was really hard going through it because I could never understand it. You know, I tried to battle through it for three years. I went through a lot of stuff with anxiety and some depression things. Um, but again, could never really put my finger on what was the root of the issue. Only recently, Hearst revealed an incident that took place in January 2016. One night, he says, he mixed pills with alcohol. Waking up the next morning in a hospital room, he found himself handcuffed to the bed. He had attempted suicide. Hearst would begin seeing a therapist regularly. He returned to the field with the Gamecocks. What a play by Hayden Hurst. Then, two years ago. With the 25th pick, the Baltimore Ravens select Hayden Hurst, tight end, South Carolina. To come full circle and be able to go through this whole process and experience this with my family, it just means the world to me. This is just a dream come true.